name is Barbara Creary. I'm the Director of International Rights uh, with Dominique et Compagnie uh, in Montreal. Uh, I sell rights mostly, sometimes I buy. Dominique et Compagnie at the beginning actually published in both languages. Most of our books were really high-end children's books. For children's books, you have the picture books, where the illustrations are 50% of it, and you have novels where the illustrations are a little less. A lot of people might like your illustrations, and then they have to like the story also. Publishers from United States, from France, from Italy saw them. They, they wanted to translate them. <laughs> The reason we actually work hard at having our books translated is so that the authors and illustrators are happy with us and they continue to live off uh, royalties from these books. So the more we sell into other languages, whether it is English, Spanish, Chinese, the more money they make from that so that they can live from, from writing. The most important thing when you're selling rights is to get an international window. In other words, go to the fairs because people have to see your books. Well, I think it's going to be a productive fair. I think we're going to come away with some sales. I've met people I've never met and who do the kind of books that uh, we do and they're interested. The more that we all do this, the, the more popular I think that the translators will become. When we decide to actually buy a translation, of another publisher's book. The marketing of that book is not very different. It becomes part of your catalog and part of everything. I think more and more people are buying the translations and they know their translated books and they still like them. <laughs> but c'est vrai, un image vaut mille mots. So a lot of times in children's books they buy for the look of the book and then they read the story.